This is my Zero 07 Pro running Aircrack. Currently B-side NG, if I can get it to focus, since I'm using my phone. But uh, it's working. I have monitor mode, and I believe possibly packet injection, but I will have to check for sure. I was just too excited after I saw that it was working to pass up the opportunity to show that monitor mode does work on the Zero 07 Pro. So hopefully someone will develop a pen testing ROM or something uh, so that we can do even more with this. And you can see it's definitely a Zero 07 Pro. It's running the Dopa ROM. So part of the reason I think it could be working is because it thinks it's a Nexus 7. But also, I have the Aircrack GUI suite installed, and it hadn't worked until I activated that. Activated and enable, <laughs> sorry, activated monitor mode on Aircrack GUI using the old method um, and the GS2 bundle for the 4330 Broadcom chipset. Um, so that might have had something to do with it too, but before it stopped working, I figured I would take a video of it so I have some proof that Nexus 7 is not the only pen testing tablet out there. This cost $129 and I um, picked it up at Walmart not too long ago. So. Hopefully some of you developers will get started so that we can have an affordable pen test tablet. Uh, maybe not with uh, GPRS or GSM data or whatever, mobile data, but still effective Wi-Fi tools. Um, but yeah, it's pretty darn amazing. Uh, but like I said, I just got it working and figured I would film it before it started and uh, hopefully I'll have some time here this weekend to look into it myself and see if I can improve it. Um, one of the things aside from B-side is you can see here I have monitor mode I can run wash And it works perfectly. You can see all the SSIDs popping up there with their MAC numbers. Close that, yes. And what else do we have? We have the Broadcod, the BC Mon terminal, which, if you see, I believe will let me run Reaver. It does. And if I had a BSS ID memorized, I would be able to show you, but the interface is not MON0, it comes up as WLAN0. So that's something. And... <laughs> yeah, if you could. Yeah, sorry. And... Like I said, sorry for the crappy photography. Oh, arrow dump, which didn't work before, but surprisingly is working now. So I'm <laughs> elated beyond words. Uh, arrow dump's functional, B side is functional, um, BC Mon terminal is functional, which gives you wash and reaver, and that in itself is enough. Now, what would be even better is if I could get Kismet and so on, but I imagine that the fake interface is. Uh, it could be connected to Kali Linux, which can be installed on here, or any other pen testing distribution. But for now, and I actually feel like it works faster than my netbook. So, like I said, for now, everything works. It's a cheap, pretty powerful tablet. Monitor mode is functioning pretty darn great right now. Although my experience with it in the past has been that I'll install it monitor mode will work great, and then suddenly it'll stop working even after I reinstall the BCMon APK. Um, 
I haven't worked out all the bugs, but at least now everybody knows it works. And that's a Ciro 7 Pro. Go to Walmart, get one, hack it and work on it, see what you can do, and get back to me, because I'd definitely be interested. Um, and just to prove... Oh gosh, I've suddenly forgotten how to use a tablet. Um, there we go, settings. Just to prove here about the tablet. And like I said, it's the um, DoPaw, I'm not even sure, ROM, Android 4.21. And if you look, you can see it thinks it's a Nexus 7, which I'm guessing is why this program works so darn well. But uh, it's got a lot of the same guts, similar Wi Fi chipset, uh, quad core. Tegra graphics, etc. Uh, as the old Nexus 7. I don't think the new one, I haven't looked into it, but for 100 bucks, it's pretty darn great. And you'll see here, and my terminal emul emulator comes up. I haven't any, even installed hacker keyboard or anything, so I can't um, control C to stop, so whatever. Oh, why does that keep happening to me? Um, I'm terrified to go back and hit BC Mon to see if the actual proper app pops up, and it does. So fantastic. And those screen refreshes are pretty nice, too. And that's about it for now. Anybody else makes any more progress, let me know. Thanks again. Bye.